YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a theatre review on Sleepless, a musical romance. I hope you enjoy it, so let's start. Sleepless was a very upbeat musical and it was based on the 1993 hit movie Sleepless in Seattle and even with a limited set I believe that they used what they had very well. After the world premiere in 2012 in LA, there was a two day London preview shown ahead of the London premiere in March 2020 due to the producer's musical rights contract with the movie. The actors were quite passionate about their roles and they have my respect for giving it their 100% for the whole show. The music had a lot of very classical musical theatre vibes coming from every song. However, it did end up dragging slightly and it ended up being quite repetitive by the end. The phrases seemed to repeat at least three times for every song and ended up making all the songs seem to last for a very long time. The music itself wasn't bad, only because of how condensed the similar songs were and how there were some misplaced encores here and there. The acting was wonderful and the actors were also good at portraying their characters. Michael D. Zaver seemed very much immersed in his character and I found him the most believable. The female lead seemed slightly nervous at the beginning since she ended the big song before the interval standing quite still and unmoving but afterwards she seemed much more into the character and was very entertaining to watch until the end. Possibly due to the limited rehearsal time, sadly some of the relationships between characters were not exactly all believable, and a child actor who played Jonah had quite a few numbers throughout the show, and he did a great job through the end. He had a lot of things to do, and even if he was trying his best, you could tell he was tired by the end. And I was outstanding at how he managed to keep going through so many songs without being short of breath. The singing was overall well done, and there were some beautiful harmonies in some of the songs, especially the ending of one of the songs in which three different women are singing about Sleepless, where they ended it off in a lovely three-part harmony. However, I couldn't ignore how there were some off-key moments throughout the show, and it ruined the mood each time. If it had been once, I would have understood how mistakes can happen and not have noticed it. But because of the frequency that this happened, it made me wonder about what harmonies a composer might have made that made the singer struggle since all of them were obviously capable of singing very well in pitch. The lyrics were also slightly questionable as I sometimes heard them and found myself cringing slightly. After some digging, I realised in the process of making the song, there was a lot of composer changing and this might have caused some complications to occur. However, this is not to be an excuse to their audience that they can use as the show must always go on. The composition for the band was very well done however, and the players were all very smooth, with no noticeable mistakes at all. Their conductor also seemed to be very organised and conducted his band with vigour. Overall however, I'd like to say their story was still pretty entertaining, and even if there were some awkward moments, the cast carried the musical pretty well until the end. Perhaps by March, any problems with the singing will be cleaned up, and the singers will be secure enough with their songs so they do not have to worry about anything. I hope you enjoyed the video, please comment down below any of the opinions you had if you have watched Sleepless and tell me what you think about it. It would be very much appreciated if you could click the subscribe button as it really helps me make some more theatre reviews to give you recommendations on what to watch. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!